All right, we are here with uh, Eric Leslie at Mount Shasta, and we were talking about moon rises. May, hoping to find one maybe behind that that mountain. And he was telling me about this app. It's called <clears throat> Sun Surveyor, and it lets you sort of visualize where the sun's going to move on the horizon. So let's pan up and right. Oh, and so maybe, that green thing is supposed to be the sun. No, that's the center. The sun's over there. So if we Go this way. Okay. Whoop, almost fell into the snow. Well, I did fall in. So, that yellow dot's the sun, so it's below the horizon, so we can't see it. And so, same with the moon, but normally it would show you a trajectory where the sun's gonna move. So, what's the green? The center? That's the horizon. That's the horizon. So, you look up and the horizon moves down. Uh, no, I mean the dot, the green oh, dot. Oh, that's just the center of the camera. Okay, so what else? It tells you. Elevation, where the moon is, where the sun is, is 0.4 beneath the horizon. Moon's point, uh, negative, or, well, point negative, or four, negative four behind, underneath the horizon, and the moon is negative 12 underneath the horizon. So, and it's going to tell you where the moon is going to rise, or where it's presently at. Okay, yeah, so if we move around okay. to the east, and see that There's white red. dot is where the moon is, so it's gonna rise right above the peak. It's gonna rise above the peak. At 6.30. At 6.30. So if we stick around, it'll rise right over the peak. Huh. Which might be cool. That could be. Okay, that's Sun Surveyor, and I don't have that in the Sun Surveyor light, so maybe I should buy the full version. That's why I wanted to ask uh, Eric here, it's dark, sorry for the grainy video, about uh, to explain this because I wanted to get a rundown to see whether it was worth spending the couple extra dollars. Anyways, that's kind of a little review of uh, a product for you guys. Enjoy! And that's for Android and I'm sure it's probably on iPhone because pretty much everything's on iPhone and only some stuff is on Android. So, alright.